Take a ride in Sky 5 over Logan Airport where the FAA is testing a new device that could one day save your life. It's a sensor that detects debris on the runway. Debris that could actually damage planes and even cause crashes. New Center 5's Jack Harper joining us live at Logan to show us how it works. Jack, fascinating. Liz, they call it FOD. That's foreign object debris. It's one of the biggest threats to aviation over my shoulder on runway 15 right. They're in the process of testing a system, one of the newest in the world, which will help them detect debris. They're continuously scanning the runway, and upon detection of anything on the runway, they will alert the operator up in the tower, giving him the visual indication, the real-time video from here. They're called Excite sensors, and right now they're being tested in a small area of runway 15 right. The radar and the camera will do the detection. When the radar locates any foreign object debris, the camera zooms in on it. That's actually a pen. That's a pen that was placed down there on the runway. Out here on the runway, you don't even really see the Excite device. You have to look for it or have an expert show it to you. It's right here, situated alongside the lights. And the idea is it has a perfect panoramic view of everything going on around it. This is one of four systems being tested by the FAA. Uh, and like I said, we're, we're happy to help out. At the conclusion of all of this, uh, the FAA will uh, assess the technologies and come up with some guidance, and we'll assess it at that point. The view from Excite is incredible. Right now, debris control is done by people at work, some assigned to look, others just watching out for trouble. The Excite works all the time. This is an 18-inch piece of metal similar to the one that brought down the Air France Concorde in the year 2000. Excite developers say their device could have prevented that disaster. As you can see, we're not affecting the, the airport's view. Everything looks the same. We're just right. attaching one of those little units, little sensors to existing edge light, making the edge light uh, a smart edge light. Another big advantage is if they find a piece of, for better, lack of a better term, aircraft junk out there, they could find it immediately and know perhaps which plane it came off of, and that would be important to the people on board that plane, obviously. Cost? You bet it's expensive. Probably somewhere in the area, $2 million per runway. Massport will be considering that down the road when they hear more from the FAA. At Logan, I'm Jack Harper, New Center 5.